Hello everyone, Floorponics here. Just doing an end of week update on the uh, hydroponic systems. The uh, Floorponics Tower Garden, 21 Tower Garden, it's doing good. I have three clones in here that are seem to be doing okay. Uh, hopefully they take root and uh, jump up in size. But the uh, Trinidad Scorpions, they're, they're a little slow, even the ones I have in the uh, soil are growing a little bit slow up in uh, regular soil. But uh, here goes the hybrid jelly bean. They have outgrown the trellis that I built into this uh, raised planter. But uh, still producing a lot of flowers. Hopefully it germinates sometime soon, but uh, looking good. And uh, here goes the the lemongrass I planted. As you can see, there's some straggler Thai basil that happens to be in here, which is kind of funny. They didn't germinate the last round and uh, moved the soil a little bit and cleaned up and uh, getting ready for the lemongrass. And now we have one, two, three four or five, I mean, at least five stragglers from the uh, from the Thai basil uh, harvest. As you guys see, I, I kind of prune this a lot to get rid of some of the dead growth. But uh, yeah, it's still fruiting really well. They're, these are my older plants, uh, doing really well and uh, pruning it, trying to give it energy and oxygen to flow around so the uh, tomatoes can grow nice and strong but it, I mean as you can see it's growing super tall tomatoes are still sprouting all over the place I'm gonna give it one more pruning uh, down on this plant and uh, make it happen but uh, so as you can see sometimes the heat kills the new growth so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna trim those leaves off that are getting sunburnt basically and uh, but guess what we have this is the plant that I I didn't top, and as you can see, we have some beautiful Thai chilies, or Thai peppers. These are the hot ones. These are the longer of the two, but they are super good and super, they got a nice heat to it, good flavor. Well, they're, they're growing. This is the other one, it's, it's starting to flower, but um, as you can see, the new growth, it's kind of got burnt by the sun. Uh, same thing with these guys. These guys were flowering really well. Um, hopefully it doesn't affect the peppering. But uh, these, oh, I got some mold on them, but I had to kind of kill them. Hopefully they rejuvenate and become good, good strong Thai bird peppers. I think the uh, peppercini plant might have lived its course or it's time to go. But as you can see, the hot lemon pepper is huge. I mean, look at that. That fence is over six feet tall. That thing is at least five feet, if not taller, you know? It's just crazy. But as you can see, I found a lemon pepper growing right here. Never had one but uh, it's gonna be tasty. I can't wait to try it. Um, I've been waiting for this plant to produce for a while. It's been through a lot. I started it indoors, um, brought it outdoors, almost killed it. Did a lot of pruning and as you can see, it's just amazing on how big this plant really is. Anyways, uh, thanks for tuning in. Uh, hit the like button if you have any comments or or uh, questions please do not uh, hesitate um, I'm still uh, having maintenance done on my body so we will not be opening uh, possibly this weekend or this month so look for us uh, in September with uh, brand new hands and good to go back to work all right floor out